What's up guys, it's your boy Rizzo McNeil, we're back here on NBA 2K14 with Historic Packs. That's right, today is the new day that 2K announced that they're going to put single Historic Packs in the market. What? Yes, that makes it a lot easier now to get Diamond LeBron, or uh, Diamond LeBron, Diamond Jordan, just because as you can see on the screen here, we are going to open up the Seattle Supersonics, and we are going to get Gary Payton, we're going to finish off the collection here. Oh my god, man, forever, forever it took me to get this this collection uh, with the other Historic Packs, man, you were just... I was just opening and opening and opening, getting doubles after doubles after doubles. There you go. As you see right here, the first pack we get, Gary Payton, and we're going to complete the Supersonics, and we're going to get motherfucking Sean Kemp. Man, he'd be a great addition to my roster. I'd like to welcome you guys to this uh, to my channel and to this video. As you know, I'm, I got a Diamond uh, uh, LeBron James out and a Diamond Jordan. I do have tons and tons of footage of the collections I've collected from the historic packs which I'm going to go through and edit and I'm going to make other videos for you guys to sit back and watch this too uh this is just a mini little episode right here where you know where we're just going to talk and, and and have some fun here open up some of these historic packs maybe we can complete some collections we're going to go with some old school Knicks here now with this pack I've been getting doubled and it's just been rough and we're going to open up let's see what we're going to get, what we're gonna get. Nope, nothing. Not a fucking thing out of this. All right, let's try again. Contracts. Yeah, shit I don't need. Shit that I'm just gonna end up quick selling anyway and eventually never ever use. Let's see if we can get, we only need one more card for this. I think we need like Monty Williams and that will give us Patrick Ewing from the, the 95 Knicks. Here goes a couple Boston packs. And let me tell you, man, this makes it a much easier, easier way to to get these cards. Like, boom, another card right there. You know, so, you know, it gives everybody an opportunity to get Diamond Jordan. Because if you don't know, you got to collect all the historic players and you will get Diamond Jordan. Now, I hear a lot of rumors about the Diamond players aren't really worth much. They're only, like, their, their stats are only different. Like, I, I did some research. Like, I think, like, LeBron James, like, defensive stats, like, the only thing that's actually changed from the gold LeBron James. But they are so pretty to have. I remember growing up as a little kid, and we were collecting cards. And, you know, you get the special players. But they weren't really much better than the, the regular cards, except that they only had a little bit of extra value. But I always wanted it because I had to have the best. I want to get the best. And for some reason, an all-diamond team is going to look sexy. And that's my goal before NBA 2K15 comes out, which I already have pre-reserved. Wait, let me rephrase that. Not even pre-reserved. It's already bought. I just bought the whole entire thing. I don't like putting $5 down and wasted them. I'll just go ahead and just pay for the whole entire game. And then I don't have to wait for it. So when I go there... I just go pick my game up from GameStop and then I leave. Here we're just going to open up some 3,700 packs. You know, I'm not really too worried about the Jazz. They are cheap, but I want to get the bigger players first so I can keep stacking my lineup. Nothing much going on here in these packs. I mean, the 3,700 packs are what you get. You pay for what you get, man. There's not really much going on in these packs. You know, when you're paying 6K or 10K or 13K per pack, you will get the, you know, you get what you pay for. So... Here we're not really expecting much, but I figured I had to open up a couple just because uh, you're 3,700 and mine as well, right? So here we go. We're going to go Atlanta Hawks. I stayed away from this collection because I did buy a couple cards out of this pack, and for some reason I just never pulled any Atlanta Hawks. So here we go. Pulled first one here, Cliff Livingston. Not really great at all, you know. If I wasn't going for, for Michael Jordan, then I would just quick sell him. But since we are going for a Diamond Jordan, we need all the players that we can get. Here we go, open up another Knicks pack. Let's see what we got going on here. Remember, we only need one more card, and then after I get this whole this this card right, oh, we're gonna get him. Patrick Ewan. The Knicks completed. That whole historic pack now is not completed. I got all the all the Sixers, all the Knicks. I think the, the Pistons are in that, and I Lakers maybe the '98 Lakers. I think. I think the Lakers are in that one. I'm not pretty sure. You know, I don't have anything written down, but. There we go. That that's completed as well. So we did get some some great pulls out of these packs, which you know makes me happy because now I don't have to spend even more money. I'm just gonna run through here real fast and just 
show you guys some collections. I'll take another video to take time out of my collections for you guys. But uh, I hope you guys had fun. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video.